basic animation in Create.js. Introducing the Easel JS Library, produced by Lon Haas Ford. This video is background information for using Easel JS to draw on the HTML5 canvas element. If you'd rather jump into the code example, feel free to skip to the next video. Easel JS is an object-oriented JavaScript library. The basic three classes in ESELJS you use to draw on the HTML5 canvas are the Stage class, the Shape class, and the Graphics class. The Graphics class is an API for vector drawing that is much easier to use than the HTML5 canvas drawing API. There are numerous drawing methods that greatly enhance and simplify the HTML5 graphics methods. You will use some of these common methods in this video series. The stage and shape classes are part of the ESL JS display class architecture. You do not need to be an expert on the display architecture, but a general knowledge of its classes is helpful in solving problems and understanding examples. At the top of that architecture is the display object class. Display object is an abstract base class for all display classes in the ESL JS library. It defines the core properties and methods that are shared between all display objects. For example, properties such as X, Y, Scale X, and Scale Y. And methods for items like caching, hit testing, and event handling. Shape is a subclass of display object. The shape class allows you to draw and display vector art using the graphics class. The key item shape adds is an instantiated graphics class object. You can use the graphics class methods directly on this property. Alternatively, you can create a graphics class object and assign it to this property. Container is a subclass of display object. It is a nestable display list that allows you to work with a composite of display objects. It adds properties and methods for handling the display list. Its key property is an array of display objects called children. The key methods deal with managing the children property. The stage class is the root level container class in ESELJS. The stage renders all contained display objects on its mapped HTML5 canvas. Key properties include the reference to the HTML5 canvas and various values for the mouse. The main method is update and used to render drawing on the canvas. In ESELJS architecture speak, drawing on the HTML5 canvas involves creating a graphics object, adding it to a display object, and putting the display object on a container that is the stage or is on the stage. In more concrete terms for our work, you will create a stage and a shape. Then you draw on the shape's graphics object, you add the shape to the stage, then you update the stage, when the stage updates, the shape and its graphics object show on the canvas. The next video will put these concepts to use. Thank you for watching.